This is Gay Science. In today's episode, why are gay coworkers either best friends or mortal enemies? All gay men have a dominant and submissive work trait that leads to different outcomes when placed together. 50% of the time, there will be a homo-heterozygous relationship where the traits balance to lead to a gay work bestie. Some signs of this dynamic include sharing all the juicy work gossip, discussing which straight coworkers might be gay, agreeing that all your coworkers are at least a little bit gay, and sharing drug contacts. The other 50% of the time, there will be a homo-homozygous relationship and gay adversaries. With two recessive traits, it will be passive-aggressive. Here are some classic behaviors. He's condescending because he thinks he's hotter than you. He's condescending because he thinks you think you're hotter than him and microwaving buttered popcorn all day because he knows you're on a low-carb diet. With two dominant traits, the work feud will be aggressive and intense. Expect things like never using your name, instead calling you the other gay guy, tapping his gay circles to dig up your worst rumors, then breaking gay code by telling your straight coworkers, taking load after load after load, and writing there can only be one on your desk in blood. 